Hello there, my Scorpio Collective. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Oh my goodness, Scorpios. Some of you could be taking online classes or thinking about online classes. Some of you, there's an elevation energy here. You're wanting to learn and grow, uh, Scorpio. So what's inspiring you right now? What's inspiring you right now? Will of Fortune, Knight of Wands, King of Swords, the Moon, the Eight of Swords. Ooh, and the Eight of Cups. My, oh my. Damn. Uh, Scorpio, if you pay attention to your astrology, uh, some of y'all retrograde could have been really important to you. My, oh my, oh my. Scorpio, 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 don't be afraid to go do your own fucking thing here. Gee, my knee. You had to learn or understand something here, Scorpio. So some of you, this could have been a very sort of uh, uh, emotional time for you. Nine of Pentacles, Judgment, Six of Pentacles, here with that Five of Wands. Oh. Fucking hell, Scorpio. <laughs> this is good retrograde energy. So, uh, Scorpio, some of you are, like, in retrograde energy. Uh... Scorpio, some of you had to sort of do that retrograde. So something was kind of counterintuitive to you, uh, Scorpios. Uh, that sort of made this transitional energy for you work. My oh my. There's a lot here, Scorpio. There's a lot here. I feel like you avoid the conflict, though. Whatever the sort of Five of Wands energy is. So, Scorpio, if things weren't working before, right? You sort of trusted the energy here. It's like you pulled that retrograde energy back. You know what I mean? My, oh my, Scorpios. You were able to navigate this energy very nicely. So what's been your inspiration, Scorpio? What's been your sort of... Uh, um, some of you definitely a transformative energy here with you. What's interesting you right now? Three of... Yeah. You're not like everybody else. There's a difference here with you. My Oh, my, Scorpio. Seven of Swords. Your intuition is on point. Scorpio. My, oh my, Eight of Cups, Queen of Cups, Ace of Cups, Knight of Pentacles to the Six of Cups. Damn. Scorpio, this is almost like you were ahead of the trend. You know what I mean? Uh, sweet Jesus, Scorpio, there's a lot here. Um, man, you trusted your gut, your guidance, and your intuition on something here. You were different. So you were very comfortable in this energy. You almost felt like a retrograde. Something felt very counterintuitive to you, but it was actually to your benefit. Uh, so Scorpio, you didn't put time, energy, and effort into anything that kind of wasn't or didn't have a flow to it. You know what I mean? Because you over here in your own field. So your intuition was definitely on point. Uh, it's like you were ahead. Um you don't follow trends. I don't even think you set trends. You just sort of understand the energy here. My, oh my. Fucking hell, Scorpio. You are definitely different. You're different. You don't follow the trends. You set the trends. This is, this is very interesting for you. You felt this sort of energy switch up. Some of you like a retrograde energy. But something was just very counterintuitive with you here. All this cups energy is like you sort of uh, a beautiful release energy right here. Uh, 
Scorpio. Oh, whatever the hell this is. You kind of avoid that sort of uh, bottleneck energy, uh, Scorpio. You know what I mean? What even is this for you? Some of you, it could have been relationships, partnership energy here with that three of cups. Uh, you took your time. You're definitely in this beautiful, uh, you feel good, you look good. There's wish fulfillment energy here, Scorpio, but it's you're, it's different from like uh, the norm type energy. You know what I mean? If you fo uh, follow your astrology, some of you, that could have been what sort of navigated you here. You're very street smart and wise. You're trusting your gut, your guidance, and your intuition. Four of Wands, yeah, the Star, Queen of Wands, the Three of Cups, the Nine of Swords with the Eight of Wands. My, oh my. You didn't miss out on anything, Scorpio. But I don't feel like you felt that you were. You know what I mean? You definitely stand out. You definitely stand out here, Scorpio. Something was very counterintuitive with you. You trusted it. You avoided that five of wands, uh, Scorpio. Look at that, because you're not in that uh, nine of swords energy. So you didn't sort of tap in uh here uh <laughs> scorpio uh you didn't really you don't follow the trends i don't think you necessarily set them but you don't follow the trends here and that's what made all the fucking difference you're your own unique person here you trusted this energy too so if there was a group dynamic with you uh scorpio you just kind of did your own thing here which is actually very good for you I mean, what the fuck even is this for you, Scorpio? Work-life energy here? Whatever the stagnant energy was, you're glad you took the time that you needed. You know what I mean? Damn. Knight of Pentacles, Ten of Wands, the Hermit, the Will of Fortune energy, the Hierophant... Ooh, and the Emperor energy. My, oh my, your intuition is definitely on point. Mm. Scorpio, for some of you, though, this has kind of felt a little slow and, and dragged. It's like a ret retrograde. It's counterintuitive energy, right? You're kind of going against the flow, but you sort of trusted your, your guidance on this. Very tuned in and tapped in. This puts you ahead. You know what I mean here, Scorpio, in the sense that you're in this beautiful peace, love, and light, beautiful energy over here. Instead of being stuck and sort of stagnant. You didn't miss an opportunity. You didn't miss... Uh, so you don't follow uh, the trends. You don't set the trends, but you don't follow the trends. You definitely trusted this energy. If you... Uh, do astrology your astrology could have factored into this some of you just went with the flow and then kind of went against the flow you realize that wasn't your thing so you don't really follow a group dynamic i love this for you you didn't miss anything though scorpio that's the fucking beauty of it
Work, love, life, energy on that, Scorpio, whatever the hell that is. You'll feel it. It's like uh, you just sort of did your own thing. Something was definitely very counterintuitive. It was like uh, going against uh, the flow. But you trusted it, especially when it came to this sort of emotional energy here, right? Oh, we belong together. Okay, Mariah Carey. Let's talk about sex, baby. Okay, a little salt and pepper. I'll be alright as long as there's light from a neon moon. Ooh, Aerosmith. Dream on, dream on it. Oh my goodness. Sorry about that, Scorpios. I love that song, but that is definitely a hard motherfucker to sing. My oh my. So Scorpio, you were definitely in control of your emotions here. A lot of energy here. Ah, uh, Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. Some of you, when it came to relationships and partnerships, you didn't miss out on anything. Um, You trusted your guidance on something. Some of you, it was like a retrograde, but that felt like going against that sort of emotional pull, right? So something was very counterintuitive with you. And it worked. It definitely worked. Elevation energy here. Scorpio, some of you, when it came to relationships or partnerships, right? I mean, you could have had many different offers or opportunities. I don't feel like that's sort of the issue with you, uh, Scorpio. It's uh, figuring out what's a good mix for you. You stand out here, but you have healthy boundaries in place. You know what I mean? My, oh my, Scorpio. Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. <coughs> Excuse me, Scorpio. Because isn't that God bless? Emperor energy here. Queen of Wands with the Five of Pentacles. Some of you, this could have been a good business opportunity that you missed the fuck out on. You didn't go with the flow, uh, Scorpio. That made all the fucking difference. My oh my. My oh my. Mm. You didn't miss anything, Scorpio. You trusted your energy here. You trusted this sort of Oh, it was very counterintuitive with you. You went against the uh, the grain. You went against the flow, the natural flow. You trusted something. My oh my, Scorpio! If you throw astrology on this, it could you could have been paying attention to your astrology. Some of you dating opportunities. <laughs> it's like you trusted the energy. You went with the flow. And then, you know, that wasn't what the hell you were interested in. My, oh my. Good upgrading energy right here, though, Scorpios. So, damn. You didn't miss anything, <laughs> Scorpio. <laughs> you don't follow trends. I don't think you set trends, but you didn't miss anything. How do you get a good opportunity out of something? My, oh my, Scorpio. Work, love, life energy on this, uh, Scorpio, to be quite honest with you. You definitely went against the norm. There was that sort of retrograde energy, but that just feels like something being counterintuitive with you. But it worked. Some of you could have been relationships. Uh, you know? Eight of Cups, Eight of Pentacles, Eight of Wands energy right here.
This was very interesting for you. This was very interesting for you. That's kind of what sets you apart, uh, Scorpio. And that's what makes all the difference with you right here. Ooh, a lot of hard work there. A lot of hard work there. Queen of Wands to the Five of Pentacles. I don't feel like you missed anything. You know what I mean, Scorpios? You didn't miss anything. Mm. Take what your Scorpio, leave what the fuck is not. You're calling in some good energy here. Because you just sort of did your own thing. Just like you had faith, love, hope, I don't know, whatever the hell you were doing. It worked for you. Damn. Someone definitely likes your style. Good luck, God bless, Scorpio. Take what yours. Leave what the fuck is it. There could be some spirituality on this. There could be some astrology on this. Whatever your sort of uh, energy flow is, uh, uh, Scorpio. Right? You didn't miss anything. You didn't miss anything. You actually avoid, avoided whatever that Five of Wands energy was. Good luck, God bless, Scorpio. Like, share, subscribe. <laughs> Peace, love, and light.